What happens after the buzz of a bike's debut wears off? Average motorcycle ownership lasts four or five years, but in a press fleet we may only see it for one or two. What happens after that? Sometimes we end up buying one, like this 2015 Husqvarna Faye 350S, and find out. In 2015 its debut reap acclaim and awards. And why wouldn't it? Its spec sheet is littered with the best parts of KTM and Husaberg. From KTM Adoc 350cc 4-stroke motor, Brembo brakes, and WP suspension. From Husaberg, a linked shock and polyamide rear subframe. From Husqvarna, that color scheme and links to 110 years of motorcycling heritage. Complementing all this engineering is a design burst from a tantric evening between an F-22 Raptor and a mountain bike. The result weighs 240 pounds, outputs 45 horsepower through wide ratio 6-speed transmission, and on the S, has a license plate. When it was new, we named it stable made the Fay 501 s the best enduro slash dual sport of 2015. None of this mattered to me, though. I happened to be wedged underneath all this premier componentry after falling into a muddle puddle in Buffalo, Illinois. It was my first outing on my new to me 2015 Husqvarna Fay 350s its purchase came from an equal measure of ego, impatience, and a heaping measure of rationalization. On the ego side was this, street riding in Chicago is boring. Riding on the dirt will make me faster and be more fun. Think of the activities. Think of the radness. On the impatient side, browsing for used dirt bikes is about as much fun as finding an avocado in the trash can. Sure you can get lucky, but most times they'll be rotten to the pit. I was over sifting through claptraps and monster decals, and $5 K drive Z400S. And the rationalization. It's a good deal I told myself, newer too, and with a plate. This is no flippant buying decision, this is a rational, adult one. And it will be way more reliable than some second-hand heap. I was signing the papers at BMW of Countryside before this internal argument was over. Hi Bob. I was brilliant. My fiancé disagreed. Like most things, she was right. Kind of.